Just bought the SNS Weber Kettle Grill. Brand new. I gotta season it, which is put some charcoal in there and let it cook let it cook everything for like two hours. This isn't the grill that I'm going to use. I'll use it sometimes. And then the charcoal separator. I'll use it sometimes too. But I got other stuff that's coming that hasn't arrived yet that I want to put down here. It's a charcoal separator and it's Mallory cast iron instead of this which is this isn't bad either I'm gonna try it out see you put water in there you put water and charcoal over here so you can put moisture in your smokes <laughs> and listen good quality SNS and down here is how you open up the holes like that all the way all the way like that Kind of covers it right there it's all the way open so I got a smoke hole over there that I can use and leave these closed and just use this smoke hole and it'll come right through and put air to less charcoals I want the charcoals over here or over there and do a smoke <laughs> and keep everything um, at and you can keep it at 250 degrees and not even come out here to mess with it because what you do is you light six charcoals right there in a pile let them ash over and get the rest of the charcoal and throw it over those charcoals put a couple of them on top and it'll go like a snake out that way and you put a chunk of wood like hickory or whatever flavor you want to use pecan white oak whatever mesquite right there and you can put a big ass piece of meat right here like a rack of ribs, pork butt, whatever. And you set this like that. What I learned from that guy on YouTube is there's clothes, there's all the way open right there, and kink it just a little bit in case you see some right there. That's a good spot, and it'll go to 250. It'll go to 250 and it'll stay there for hours upon hours because this is a good heat conductor but what he got which what I'm waiting for is something better than this um, charcoal separator it's even thicker it's like a, a half inch thick or more I don't know but it, it's the grill, the bottom grill, it's thicker than the separator. It has little slots. And on top of that, also, I got another grill coming too. It's a Mallory cast iron grill for the 22 inch Weber kettles. It can go on any Weber kettle. 
but I got this one it's a premium because it has a wood thing um, a, a, a smoke hole and I don't know what else it has that's premium I haven't looked into it too much but I just got it because I can't use that small one anymore I want to do smokes and I didn't want to bring the 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 Oklahoma Joe smoker over here and I won't have no room it would have been covering up the whole backyard so this thing $800 later is going to be worth the while I'm telling you $800 but I'm making payments I'm not paying it all at once 100 bucks a month that's how much I'll pay I ain't going to pay $800 right now all at once and this is a set it like that cool man and I had guys come and set it up for me because this was a bitch for one person to go through this whole manual it would have took me a good three hours I would have been out here probably till night doing this shit they got here at, they got here like around 5.30 and they got done at 6.45 it took them an hour and 15 minutes for two guys to put it all because it was a lot I, I, I gave them their space out here Gave them their space, whatever little space this is. And they made it work. Got it done. And they were really good. I needed it. Definitely. I didn't want to do this myself, man. It would have took forever. Look at that high quality thermometer. <sighs> the thing about this is what I seen in the videos it's a good heat conductor it will stay at a good temperature for a really long time and that means it does not need to use that much charcoal and it's gonna save me money in the long run that's what I needed this is gonna be a good one so I'm gonna get to seasoning it now Definitely worth the worth the money.